Hey everybody, how's it going? I thought I would do a haul video because I went on kind of a unique shopping trip today and looked in the bag of stuff I bought and thought it was kind of funny, so I wanted to share with you. I am preparing to go on vacation to California, so I bought all of the little like mini sizes of things. So this is my Target and Sephora haul of travel items. Hopefully you'll see something in there maybe and you're like, oh, I'm traveling. I didn't know they had that, I will buy that. So without further ado, I put both of them in this Target bag. So let's take a look at what's in here, shall we? Uh, this one I already opened, it is a charging cord for my phone because my Apple provided one uh, crapped out on me. It just, you know how they kind of like get broken here and then they're useless. So I can't go traveling without a suitable charger. So I have this to keep my phone going. And then uh, I'm just gonna pull stuff out and whatever comes out, what comes out. I would travel Skin Timid Raspberry Rain Shaving Cream. Um, I just always feel like you need the little ones. So have this on hand. I don't think this is what I normally would buy, but it was in the thing, so I bought it. Next up, oh, this is for my boyfriend, Jim. He needs a uh, bottle for his body wash, so I got him a little reusable bottle because he's better for the environment today than I am because I bought reusable stuff. Um, so that's his. I also have, oh, I have two of these. I'm gonna dig in for the other one. It's Listerine Ultra Clean. I bought one for me and one for Jim because sharing mouthwash grosses me out. I'm always convinced it's cross-contaminated. Um, so there's one for me and one for him. And we both like Listerine, so that's what I bought for each of us. Then, ooh, for me, there's a, uh, this is from Sephora. And I'm gonna come back to it, actually, until I find its pair. Oh, toothpaste, Crest Pro Health, which is what I do use normally. I believe I got one in, one for me and one for Jim as well, because also sharing toothpaste versus me out, I'm weird like that. Then I bought him, oh, that's mine. It's a lot of deodorant, so I have hit, I bought Degree Dry Protection for him, because I couldn't remember if he uses this in, or Old Spice, but I'm like 95% sure he uses Old Spice, but maybe he'll like this one, I don't know. And for me, I got um, Dove Advanced Care, just a little one for me. And it's in Cool Essentials, and it has a little cucumber on it, so cucumber time. And then I'm trying this, it's a Neutrogena body oil, a sheer moisturizing experience, because I have super dry skin in the winter, especially when traveling, I think you're dehydrated a lot when you are flying planes, and I've heard that oil is better than lotion and it was also more compact so I'm gonna try body oil I'll let you know what I think can't it cannot hurt because my skin is so dry and then a little thing of Altoids for you know the plane just so I don't get stinky oh another Crest Pro Health the other toothpaste oh and his Old Spice Swagger and so hopefully he appreciates the travel size of this and if he it's kind of tiny so if he runs out back up and then I bought a mini first aid kit to go because you never know what could happen. So it has essential first aid items. It has two hand cleansing wipes. So if you're, you know, dressing the wounds that you clearly are going to get on vacation, you can clean your hands first. Four gauze packs. Jesus, what do they think is going to happen to me that I need gauze packs? Two band-aid bandages. And then four the smaller band-aids, and then a durable plastic case. Cool, can never be too prepared. Mini loofah, I love it. Um, there's nothing wrong with washcloths at hotels, but I thought this would be kind of fun to take with me. Then, oh, uh, headphone jack splitter, because we are flying Southwest, which typically has free TV sponsored by the Southwest Airlines Rapid Rewards credit card provided by Chase, um, which is my client so I'm a big proponent of them and if Jim and I want to watch a movie at the same time we would need to split it so I got it in pink because I like pink deal with that I got this from Sephora actually it's part of the Sephora part of my trip it's Clinique take the day off cleansing oil um, oil cleansing oil especially in the winter is supposed to be really good for your skin so I wanted 
something to get my makeup off beyond the makeup removing wipes because sometimes that just doesn't get everything and I wanted an actual cleanser so I wanted to try this oil and it got really good reviews on beautypedia.com I think um, it's a site I like to check just to see what ingredients are in stuff and if they can back up the claims because the site actually digs into what the products are claiming what ingredients are in there if there's irritants if there's something that you know it's promising that it will not do and i believe this got like five stars i think it got the highest rating so i'm like Buh, done boom and i use their um cleansing balm in real life so i figured real life when i'm not on vacation so i figured that it was close and probably worked just as well oh i had this right so i bought for shampoo and conditioner because Hotel shampoo and conditioner is really hit or miss and you don't know what you're getting. I got the Bumble and Bumble Hairdressers Invisible Oil Shampoo and Conditioner, which I love. It just makes my hair smell really good. It kind of smells like fabric softener, which sounds like not the most flattering comparison, but um, you just smell really fresh and, and like comfortable. And my hairdresser recommends these um, for, because I also, I have dry, everything. I have dry hair, dry skin, whatever. So uh, it helps keep my hair moisturized in dealing with the cold temperatures of Chicago. LA will not be the same, but it is kind of dry there. So it helps to have moisturizers for your hair. Then, oh, and the other Listerine. Um, I'm going to save that one for last. I have a fun thing in there. I bought a little thing of Vaseline, not the little like lip one, but like a mini normal one because it cures all ills as well as I use it on my lips kind of morning and night um, to protect them so it's a good thing to have on hand and then also if I have any irritation from like eyeshadows or something or if I scratch my lid I'll apply it there too so recommend and then I think yeah so I had enough Sephora points to redeem for a 500 point prize or bonus gift gift that's the word it's a gift not a thing to be won so i got the dr brandt skin changing science age erasers kit and i have not opened this yet so we can check it out uh together she kind of went through everything really fast too so i know some things that are in here but i'm not entirely sure of everything because i didn't really look at it after they threw it in the bag uh okay so i opened it up it's like really pretty inside it has a nice um red tissue paper and then we have dr brand oh i've actually i think used this before microdermabrasion age defying exfoliator so it's um a skin thing i got this i think in a birch box i think maybe an ipsy one of those makeup boxes um and i used it for a while and i, I actually did really like it it's, it has really fine exfoliating beads in it and so it it just feels like it's not like ripping your skin off your face it, it feels kind of more natural uh then this looks like it is needles no more 3d filler mask it's tiny and it comes in a jar which beautypedia says is a bad thing because it destabilizes the product so you use it once and then because oxygen can get in it a little more easily i feel like my nose is running i'm sorry if that's gross um it the product isn't as effective each time and it also said about this because this was the one i remembered because it had needles in the name and i'm like yeah. uh that it doesn't do anything that it claims to do but it might moisturize so it doesn't it's not actively harmful so i feel like it's fine right uh then we have dr brand pore dermabrasion pore perfecting exfoliator so it refines the appearance of pores, deep cleans pores, smooths your skin texture. So cool, a little pancake chair. And one last thing is the, also needles no more. Wow, I don't, I don't put needles in the name. Uh, instant re wrinkle relaxing cream, expression line smoother. So I don't feel like I have a ton of, I'm like off center. Brr. Uh, I don't feel like I have a ton of wrinkles, but um, there's, you know, lines and things that you notice when your makeup is off, so it doesn't hurt to attack those, mainly like here, maybe here. I've always had stuff here, though, so that's not really a thing. I've never smoked. I think when you smoke, you get those 
wrinkles on your lips so that's a great reason not to smoke uh so i don't have those as much but you know smile lines things like that so that's it that's what i got from target and sephora for my trip um and i also have stuff stockpiled from old birch boxes old ipsies just travel stuff i've bought in the past for other trips i think i have body wash um more body wash and i think i have a little bit of lotion left maybe i'm not sure so those are things that will get sorted through and packed as well but i thought you might enjoy seeing you know the little things i found at target and let me know what your travel essentials are what can you not live without on trips um for me it's definitely comforts of home so having the shampoo that makes my hair feel really nice because you're dealing with different water and you know if you have a shampoo that you're just like oh i hate my hair then that's not fun for your trip so um and you know fresh breath that's also key so yeah, thanks for watching, and don't forget, I always forget in my videos to tell you, if you like it, please hit like. If you want to see more of this face, uh, hit subscribe, and you can see my monthly challenges that I'm trying to do, different haul videos. This is my first one, but I assume I'll do more when I go shopping for things. Uh, I also try to unbox my Ipsy and birch box and i also do stitch fix so i'm going to try to show you guys that when that arrives as well and just random other stuff so thank you so much for watching i hope you're having a great day and i hope to hear from you soon bye